Howdy folks, I am Charles Daring and we are going to work on a pattern where all proceeds, every last penny, will be donated to charity. Uh, in the description you'll see, if you're watching on YouTube, you'll see the the uh, links to the charities that the donations will go to, either all of them or uh, one of your choosing, however you want it to be spread out we can go that route this is the piece we'll be working on now at the time of me sitting here although this is for charity i still nothing is going to change as far as how i do the live streams regarding making a pattern but one thing i'm going to decide while we're working on it is whether or not we're going to do it from one single sheet of paper or too. The reason being because the closer up I get, if I split the picture in half, I can get a little more detail in. But if I do it on a single sheet of paper, the detail will be smaller. But I think we're going to go with the, the larger. So that is the difference that is made when you choose to do a picture on a single sheet of paper or, or uh, two sheets. It's a little bigger, as you can tell, if you compare the sizes of the, of the koala. So that's the route we're going to go. And if you if you've watched other pattern related live streams, then you will hear me repeat a lot of the same things. Nothing will be different about this live stream as far as uh, me showing how I make a pattern on paper. Uh, I will give you every thought process I have as to why I'm having it, and you'll see me change my mind in real time. There's no editing because it's live. The only thing that makes this particular live stream different is that is the donating to charity uh i'm not the only one that's doing this kind of thing uh regarding donating to charity through the scroll sawing community or making in general every last penny once this is made into a pattern and put on woodenvisions.com i will link to that once it's up on the site i'll put the link in the description for people that aren't watching it live uh but every last penny of the proceeds of selling this pattern will go to Australian charities. And those charities are mentioned in the description. If you want to give on your own, however you decide to do it. But uh, the only thing I can control is where the proceeds of the pattern sales go to. So that's the case of what we'll be dealing with. Uh, both Wesley Balco and Russ Meadows have the, have the, uh, the link to get in here. And speaking of the devil, we'll get to Wesley Balco now. Wes. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Appreciate you joining us. I, uh, I'm i going to uh, put it back on here. But uh, again, I hope even if you can't stand me, folks, if you <laughs> if you want to help Australia, if you don't trust me to do this, then I won't tell you how to feel. But uh, I'm going to mute you for a second. Uh, Wes, no offense. Uh, I can't tip up, tell people how to feel about me, but if there's any part of you that does not trust me to send all the proceeds of the pattern sales to charity, then please follow your gut. I'm not going to tell you how to feel about me or whether or not I can be trusted. So, you know, follow your own gut on that. But for anybody that knows me and knows I'm a man of my word and every penny will go to charity. Uh, so if y'all can help me, not for my sake, but for Australia's sake, if y'all can help me spread the word about what's what's happening here. Uh, so there we go. We have Mr. Wesley Balco joining us, uh, also known as Coach in Scroll Saw Cafe on Facebook. But I'll let him tell everybody where he can be found if anybody so chooses. I, I just want to know why you felt the need to mute me while you talked about people trusting you. <laughs> because you had a lot of background noise going on. <laughs> That's the only reason I muted you. <laughs> it's not hard to derail me, so there, there's that. Uh, no, yeah, sure. I, I got it. I, I was taking a stroll through the graphs here. so. Uh, I hear you. And I know you weren't trying to be rude. It's just sometimes things are picked up easy on microphone, and that's the only reason I muted you there. So I do what, have a pretty sensitive mic. I uh, hear you, by golly. I do too on this uh on this blue yeti thingy. But uh 
again, not everybody has seen every live stream we do and start to finish. So uh, yeah, I often repeat things you've seen in past live streams if you watched uh, live feeds regarding patterns. I'm exhausted right now, but I said I, I said I would do this, so we're going to do this. First thing I'm going to do is uh, cut off the excess white areas and then attach, and then we'll. Since this is larger than a single sheet of paper, it will overlap into a second sheet, but this side will go probably pretty darn quickly. This side will take a little bit longer because I want to add some detail to the koala. And just a piece of, it, of, of trivia, in case nobody's ever watched a past live stream, but I've discussed it. Koalas are not bears. They're often called koala bears, but they are not bears. They are marsupials, which is like a kangaroo, same, you know, animal family, so to speak. Oh, yeah. Really? So we are just going to cut off the white areas. You have a train going on in the background over there. Yeah, I'm gonna mute myself for a few minutes. <laughs> I uh, forgot what I was gonna say because that's what I do. And we, what I'm showing here is that we do scroll saw patterns on paper. Uh, that's why there's a piece of glass under here. It's not just for cutting the paper off. It keeps the pen from skipping on the texture of whatever's underneath the paper. And with the glass, there's no texture. If there is, then you're using a bad piece of glass. And so that's why I'm using the sheet of glass. There's a pattern being in progress on the other side of it. It's why there's stuff taped to the back side of it. And somebody might have started a rumor since my last live feed because there's only four people watching, but that's okay. <laughs> she started a rumor about me, Wes. No, sir. I only <laughs> spread the truth. <laughs> hey, man. There you go. That's... Okay, so it's going to be a little bit wider than a standard sheet of paper by about that much. So, yeah, we'll be doing two halves here. This half will go pretty quickly. About the only severe changes from the photograph will be, you know, making the letters not fall apart by avoiding floaters. I'm tired too, Wes, believe it or not. I took a late nap, but I'm still exhausted. I, I can tell you're talking a little slower than normal. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm moving slower than normal. I'm taping the two <laughs> halves together. I don't usually use <laughs> I don't usually uh, scotch tape stuff together. We have Mr. R Russ Meadows joining us. Hello, Mr. Russ. What's going on? Oh, a lot of not. I would say while you're, well, while you're doing that taping there, I will say I just released my, I'm, I'm not really releasing the final render, but I did release the rough sketch of my sunflower and tarja pattern just a minute ago. Oh, really? We have Naves Woodworker, which is John Nave. Uh, Daniel Davis is here. Appreciate you, fellas. And uh, Wes, you want to tell people where to find that? They or can find that on Facebook at the Scroll Saw Cafe. What if they do not have Facebook? And I will probably... <laughs> that is... <laughs> uh, we lost your audio there, Wes. It's my um, that's the only place to see it. Yeah. Uh, but if they would like it requested sent to an email, I can do that also. Well, I got it. So there's that. And Wes, Wes, pretty darn good designer. He also does Intarsia. Not too shabby, if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> I will say... Know? In, in the very near future, I am going to jump in and do my first Kathy Wise pattern. Oh, look. Oh, Kathy go. Wise and Judy Gale Roberts are uh, uh, Intarsia designers, as is Bruce Worthington, Jeanette Square. I don't remember if she only cuts Intarsia or if she designs as well. I know her and Bruce Worthington worked together for a while. Oh, diddly. Man, I'm tired. Uh-oh. Uh I did see the, uh, I believe she released it just either today or I saw it today. Or the past few days. Um, the 
your audio keeps going in and out there, Wes. And hello, Dennis, over on YouTube. Mountain Lion. Okay, sorry if I interrupted you, Wes. Your audio is going in and out, so I thought you were done, and then suddenly your audio popped. He back. was stopping to he was stopping to listen and into the thoughts in yeah, his head. Yeah, I was head. having a little trouble there, and then I had a bunch of sirens come by, so I <laughs> muted myself. <laughs> yeah. And he says Wes ain't too bad. That's nice of him to say. But uh, yeah. it was the mountain lion pattern that she just recently released that I saw, and I really like it. That's cool. So I'm gonna. You know, that's what, you know, not that you have to follow my advice, but I don't know a whole lot of people doing Intarsia on YouTube. I could be wrong because I don't search for Intarsia because I, I haven't ever done Intarsia. I, I've only done a few videos, short videos on. Oh, that was when I first really started getting involved with Hector's group about two and a half years ago. Right, right. Because because of the lengthy process that goes into it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's one reason I haven't done it. That's then another reason I haven't done it. And sure, yeah. I had several people that didn't like me doing the live videos on my cutting and carving part of it. Why? Gave me a bunch of safety fits about losing fingers. And next thing I know, I'm missing half a finger. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> I hate it when but, I prove them right. <laughs> but by God, I had my safety glasses on that day. <laughs> Man, that your piece of your finger did not put your eye out. <laughs> <laughs> when, right, when, the, don't get derailed. when the router bit went across <laughs> the finger, there was no fine. And then putting it back together. Your audio is going eight crappy again, just so you know. But yeah, we were talking about your yeah. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. I right a bit across the finger is not a nice thing to have happen. Tis not. Oh yeah. <laughs> Man, I'm suddenly crashing as far as energy. Okay, but we're gonna get this. We get almost all of it on there. It comes up to where does it come up to? Comes up to about here. And I said half my finger. I, it's not really a half. It's about a. Wait. I, I got. Show it on the finger. Give us the finger. finger. Give us the finger. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Ay, caramba. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I don't have Barbara over here. <laughs> And that's when it all hit the fan. <laughs> yeah, that's what it does. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, no, I didn't do that right. I turned it wrong. I'm an idiot. Okay, let's try this again. My brain is, man, I'm just fading fast. I don't know why. Uh, not not health-wise, just tired. Uh, but I committed myself, so, or I need to be committed. But we're, we're going to do this. Okay, so... <laughs> I'm going to find something of some kind of weight to hold it down, and the only thing close by is my phone. So, Dennis said he had to stop carving because he couldn't hold the chisel due to surgeries on his hand. That makes sense. It does. That. I think a lot of, and I'm guessing here, but I would imagine part of the struggle of learn, learning to carve is getting used to how different woods work when you try to carve them, and like grains and and uh, what you call it. Yeah, grains and hard hardness. I, I I never really got into the chisel carving. All mine is done with the Dremel, and now I don't even use the Dremel anymore. I'm using the the wonderful little micro motor. Okay, so that's what they call power carving. There's a there's chip carving. Power, there's carving. power carving. I'm just when a, I <laughs> when I screw up, I want to do it with power tools. <laughs> Daniel Davis says Wes has a video of cool dust collector set up for the for all the, for the Pegasus. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Apparently, Wes is paying Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> and what Dan says, so I started scroll sawing. Okay. Well, Daniel, don't don't wait for it to come out of his his profits from this show. By God. Okay, and it may be obvious to some, but uh, the reason why we're taping this down is so it does not move. 
Man, I'm so tired. Wow. Um, okay, so we're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. Luckily, this is uh, Daniel Davis says, Hey Charles, I tell folks about you too. <laughs> well, I appreciate you. I missed something. What did you say I'm doing? I don't even remember. What's a who's it? Huh? <laughs> No, Daniel Davis said that you have a video of a cool dust collector set up. I said you were paying Daniel. It was just a little joke there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, the the pattern, uh, I'm going to draw a line to help me and y'all remember where it is. But the, the pattern is going to stop right about here. And I have to start on a second sheet of paper. So I'm going to use my pen to feel where the edge of the paper is. Where it is. There it is where it is i mean where is it it's right there so i'm drawing this line so that i don't bother trying to draw past it because it, there won't be anything there i will so say i should... do have have the disc on facebook and now youtube as well rolling oh so you're on youtube now i have i've spread out and i've posted a couple of videos this year like i said yeah. i was going to that's <laughs> awesome uh <laughs> Hmm. Woodnet says take a drink, Charles, and Nave's what working is trying to get West going because that's all we need. <laughs> oh, yeah. mm -hmm. I had no idea that was coming. I totally could not have predicted that. <laughs> <laughs> I just happened to open my comment back up and there it was. Yes, it was. I'm gonna I am gonna take a swig of Dr. Pepper. So I will take a shot of Pepsi. Oh, man. Oh. I just happen to have a two-liter bottle sitting at my feet. <laughs> I happen to have one sitting at mine, but right. I think we're trapping each other. Now, I happen to have one in my hand. All right. Well, that's a, that's a snapple by I got. You got that right. It, it is. is big old, right. Yep, yep. You're right. I shouldn't have called you out like that. Appreciate New subscriber, right. JP Woodworks, has subscribed to my YouTube channel. Oh, yeah. Yay. All right. So uh, uh, as far as making a pattern now, we know that there's a smudge right there on the word or on the letter, but that wouldn't translate well as a scroll saw pattern. We want that to be pretty much readable or legible, whatever the word is. Um, but since these letters are dark, we're going to cut them out. So we have to avoid floaters like the middle of the O, the, the E. I mean the R. As I pointed at the R, I said E because I was looking at an E. Yeah, we want to avoid floaters. And <clears throat> and we did not want to completely trace that rectangle or this whole part would fall out. So we're going to break it up at a couple corners. So there's that. And that is just, if anybody has any questions or comments, feel free to throw them out there. Man, I'm fading fast. Holy monkey. K Meyer 52172 says, very cool. I just donated a koala piece I made to a local auction, and it brought 150 for Australian Wildlife Relief. Thanks for doing this, Charles. You're welcome. Uh, K Myers, appreciate it. Who's your mic? Says, hi, everyone. Is it illegal to have a koala as a pet in Australia? I have no idea. If Aussie, Aussie man Bill joins us, he could probably answer that. I don't know. Okay. Now I could be using straight edges on here, but you know, not everything's perfectly straight here. So I'm just going to get going and I'll just start with the letters and we can roll from there. Now I could probably get away with using the straight edge on the letters. What do you, you know, no, I need to just decide. Yeah. No, they're a little bit too curved. I was going to use a straight edge, but they're a little bit curved. And we do not want any floaters, so we're going to break these up as if they were a schnitzel. And I'm, I'm tracing slow because I don't want to go off the line because they are letters. Can you explain to me what a schnitzel is? <laughs> nope. I ate it winter schnitzel once. I don't think it's quite the same thing. Long black trains derailing. 
Oh, yeah. Did you have any alcohol in your day? A little bit. <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm thinking that. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, see? It's a German snack. I was partially right. I was not overly impressed with Winter Schnitzel though. Okay. <laughs> And here's your Mac says, my wife loves koalas. <laughs> I said, of course, I would have to ask, what is a schnitzel? Hey, Siri, what is a schnitzel? <laughs> For anybody that does have Siri, I can keep this kind of on on topic here. Mm -hmm. Ask Siri why fire trucks are red. Her answer is astonishing. Lengthy. I don't know how that's on topic. Oh, fire. Okay. Firefighters. Fire trucks. Why are fire trucks red? That's all you got to ask Siri, and she will give you a very well detailed answer. Good to know. But she still has yet to find me a decent date. <laughs> well, I hope your, de your last date didn't hear that. I heard from Siri, though. Oh. Yeah. And things are going very well with Siri is uh, the CIA and the NSA, so you may not get a good date with them. Same as Alexa. Oh, I got Alexa in my house. I know the the last one before her is watching, so it's safe to say it's already going a lot better. <laughs> and stress, and I was told I did very good with that. And the reason why I'm not doing a whole lot of talking is there's not much for me to teach as far as these letters. We're just treating them like they're stencils. Okay, Meyer says same as Alexa. I guess Alexa said my fire trucks are red also. Or he's saying Alexa works the same as... How they're listening is what he means. He or she, I don't know what who that is. Uh, Jesse Ramirez says, when you're drawing the lines, what size of spar blade do you use to fit the lines, or does it matter? It's up to you. It depends on what size you want to cut it. Jesse, thanks for the question. I uh, I use primarily number three is number five, as Wes uses human, human hairs. <laughs> he can give you that. Human hair. He uses two odd. Uh, Zeros is my go-to. Yep. I do occasionally I feel kind of spunky and <laughs> I get spunky every once in a while, and I use a zero or a number one, but not oftenly. Oftenly? Yeah. That's a good word, isn't it? I uh, will make it a word for this sake. That's my word. Appreciate you joining uh, the stream, by the way, Jesse. Yeah, I'm here too, Charles. Why? <laughs> I already said appreciate you. Hey, caramba. I don't. Did did I open with my opening line? I don't remember yes, if I did or did. not. Okay. <laughs> Heck, maybe I'm the one slacking. Okay, Meyer says depends on the thickness of the wood, right? Um, going as small as the wood will allow. Yep. I do not. I don't. Do I don't always base my blade size on the thickness of wood either. A lot of times, I base it on the detail and the size that I have printed 
the pattern that even if it's on a piece that I know is really too thick for the triple zeros, certain areas I'll I'll try to get as much as I can with that triple zero before I absolutely know I, I need to upsize and go back to the double zero or zero. I'm doing all the horizontal pieces right now. Of course, they're vertical to me, but I'm just on the letters. I'm just going the same direction. And then I'll turn it around to do the other ones in the curves somewhere in there. Welcome back, Lawrence. Now, at first, I debated whether or not I was going to add the smudges and stuff, but they're in the photograph. Number one, I'm trying to stay true to the photograph. Number two, it shows that he's not just some clean-cut firefighter. And uh, Russ Meadows has a crick in his neck from watching me do this sideways. <laughs> you're, you're muted if it matters to you, Russ. I'm Wes, I but it. yeah. I was referring to Russ Meadows. <laughs> oh. oh, I forget he's in here with us, too. I haven't heard much talking. I've been, <laughs> he had his camera off. I've been kind of yeah. quiet. I've been listening to the well, group, too. You have me off camera, too. Well, you mainly oh, been listening Maple Tree to the Studios last. has just subscribed to me. What the heck is up with these? These are old notifications popping up because he subscribed a long time ago. Uh, K. Meyer saying, question for the group. What is the hardest wood you have worked on or you have cut on the Jenka scale? That uh, would be Purple Heart for me. Uh, Hoosier Mike says, my wife had a very serious accident. Very sorry to hear that. Will came off a of Tahoe, flew over the wall, dividing interstate, and landed in the windshield. The sun oh. came in and hit her head. Ow. So sorry to hear that, Mike. Is this recent? Wow. <sighs> That's one that you, you're lucky to survive, yeah. Yeah, the... Uh, not, not, not to minimize what we we just talked about, but the only floaters. If the only thing I had to really adjust is the R's, the O's, and the, yeah, just the R's and the O. Not, not to minimize uh, what you just said. Who's your mic? I'm just. I am going to add the smudges and stuff because that adds to the character of the pattern, and some of some of it is wrinkles, but most of the smudges are on this little hood here. I don't know what they call that, but. The whole the set of things called bunker gear. Both y'all just talked at once. I can't remember <clears throat> what either one of y'all said. What did you say, Russ? I said the whole suit set is called bunker gear. Oh, bunker gear. Okay. Yeah. And what did you What did you say, Wes? Okay. I may have to get out and leave. That's maybe why I can't hear Russ because you said he's talking and I heard nothing. Oh, that, yeah, that that's not the first time that's happened to you. And I'm very sorry, Mike. Yep. He says that happened Friday night. Well, go out and come back. Uh, as far as the hardest woods I have cut, one of them I can't even say. <laughs> the other one I've cut zebra wood. Uh, hedge apple is up there. And, and surprisingly, as hard as it is, it carves relatively easy. But there is... <sighs> Poo or I don't, some kind of poo. Epe. I'll have to go back and try to find that little piece of paper I wrote it down on because, yeah, I can't remember it. Okay, Meyer says, couldn't you do some creative torch burning and some light sanding for the smudges and add something unique to the piece? Yes, you can do whatever you want. I'm just referring to the girl saw pattern portion. Show Sugiban, I think they call it, is, is what Kamara is saying. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's just doing the pattern, fella. <laughs> you're yeah. going gonna to do the cutting, hopefully. Y'all can do whatever you want to the cutting. But that's not a bad idea. Have you tried iron ironwood? Ironwood. I have not tried any ironwood yet. 
a friend of mine gave me a piece of iron wood to make something out of it for him and I I I lost that in the fire. I do have a, a stash of metal cutting blades here somewhere, so eventually I'll try some iron wood. That's a joke. Everybody laughs and takes a drink now. <laughs> God almighty. <laughs> 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 I'll start oh, checking, yeah. ID, checking IDs at the door before I do these live streams. Or out blood alcohol content. Give me a breath, I only had one margarita. Come on now. But, but was it in a barrel? <laughs> <laughs> you, you got him on that one, Charles. You must have done it on an empty stomach because you're a special kind of loopy tonight. <laughs> the... Call it a fishbowl. <laughs> no, I didn't well, have okay. that much. <laughs> I'm not that kind of drinker. But something tells me I probably could be real easy. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. Huh? That's what John Nave said. Oh, yeah. Don't encourage him. He's trying. <laughs> Oh, I yeah. have a feeling it wouldn't take much. <laughs> Y'all see that Charles is trying so hard to be professional. Don't do not do it to him. Is Russ talking? Yes. I was. I'm so not I now. I hear what sounded like a whisper for a second. No, he's <laughs> talking loud as normal. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'm going to jump back. out of here and come back in and see if that fixes my audio here. All righty. Okay, I'll see you soon. All right, be good. I need to have a rule. <laughs> <laughs> he's still here. <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> Dennis asked him, did you get an IV? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. An alcohol IV? Oh, boy. There'd be a lot of people lining up at the Dagum Hospital for that thing. Well, hey, I heard you. That's good. You might want to drink out of a thimble next time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> it kind of sounds like more than one. I don't blame this on the alcohol. I told you. I'm, I'm, I'm just me. All right. Well, we appreciate you. And All I'm, right. I'm using a straight edge to just kind of guide myself. I'm not, it's just so I don't get way off the line. It's because it's not mandatory to make these letters completely perfect because they are they're embroidered onto this, you know, non-flat surface. I tell you the truth, I kind of wish I you'd hurry up and get finished with that thing because that thing blinded me. <laughs> uh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> I, I'm glad you brought that up. I tried to put my hand in front of the camera. Ah, I'm sorry about that. Yeah. Well, I don't have any black rollers here. <laughs> <laughs> It's just the way it is. I'm glad you pointed it out. Yeah, there's probably a lot of people in there that saw it, but they probably don't care one way or the other. But you're old and stuff, and you have it. I am. I'm old. Yes, and I that, am. Don't want to get anything in your eyes because it goes <laughs> emergency room. Light's okay. By God, it's the other stuff that ain't. <laughs> well, I know you've had that horrific, horrific dust in your eye. Oh, yeah. Don't start, man. Y'all going to get them started again. Uh, you could definitely go off the rails. Yes, sir. We're going to try to stay on the rails here. I don't have the energy to lose it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I also didn't realize I was so far off center. But okay. Wes, are you playing with the tape measure? Oh, you I were. Was. I was, actually. Oh, you said Russ or Wes? What did I, I? I probably. I'm, yeah, you said I'm, I'm an idiot. 
Oh. I heard my name that time. I thought he I did heard good. my name. <laughs> well, I thought I said Wes. Hey, well, don't worry I, about it. He can't hear his name. He's drunk. <laughs> <laughs> he can hear anything. That is funny. I just released the tape, and there it is. <laughs> I was just sitting here thinking, huh, I was supposed to take these uh, name plaques that I cut yesterday to work today, and they're still sitting here on the floor. <laughs> And I didn't put any hangers on them last night. What What's funny about all this is this is the one live stream I was trying to remain on the rails. <laughs> oh. uh, now, wait a minute. What's, what's John saying, especially the second last stream? No, I think it's I'm, I'm not always on the rails, but I was trying tonight. <laughs> well, so far you still are. Yeah, in spite of uh, attempts. <laughs> Wes is trying to take over their locomotive there. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, we love him. Now, if he starts asking everybody for tickets, tickets, please. <laughs> that could be the new word of the evening. <laughs> My God, if you hear that, take a drink. Now, you see. Ticket, please. The only, those two E's I did by freehand, these other ones I did a bunch of stuff with the ruler, so those look better than those two E's, but I could just copy and paste into there if I needed to. I'll see man is back. Ask him about the uh, owning a koala as a pet. Yeah, one, legal, people, one of the people in the chat wanted to know if you could own a koala as a pet there, uh, Bill. The answer is no. See, as much as much, fun, as much fun as Wes is having with that tape measure, he probably had a slinky for many years, too. I was poor growing up. I had no slinky. <laughs> <laughs> we did have bleach bottle footballs, though. Yeah, yeah. We, we, had, we had footballs. And when we got tired of playing football with the bleach bottles, we tied a string and a fishing hook on it, and we threw it in the water. Yep. All right. Bill said you need a license to, to own a koala, yeah, I'm assuming. And drink margaritas. <laughs> you don't need a license to drink margaritas. <laughs> Some people should. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if they were the barrel size. Yes. <laughs> now you get where I'm going. I do. I did then too. But I'm trying to hold it in. And I'm a certified reader drinker. You're a certified reader drinker? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> ah. You're not finished with that yet? No, but we're almost done with the, the words. Letters. I like I like how that question did not come from me this time. Which question? Which question? Ain't you done with? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> What's taking you so long? You it's must be stuck. You must be triple stacking that pattern. I got a drunk coworker <laughs> on the staff. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Don't worry, Wes. He's got nine one one on speed dial for you. Now we, uh, so do I. <laughs> <laughs> now this this line. Down, okay, go ahead. This line down here is going to be thicker than the other ones because we're dealing with the edge of the sign as or the edge of the the, the whatever the heck you call this. With uh, there's a shadow of it underneath it coming out a little bit from the jacket, so that's going to make it look. Like it's coming out from the jacket a little more, which it is. So we're going to be accurate. Well, should I even ask what you're doing right now? Roy. Well, I, 
I'm sorry. Sounds like your audio is drunk too. I, I can't turn. I couldn't make out what he said. Me neither. Your audio busted up again. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Someday I'll grow up and get some real internet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we want to break up this rectangle so that this whole, I don't know why I can't think of the word, patch? For lack patch. Of yeah, I called it a sign earlier, but yeah, we don't want it to fall through and be a, a flutter. Although the lines aren't showing much on this edge, we're still going to break it up a little bit. I'm going to break it up here and, and up here. We'll have kind of like a, no, I'll just break it up in two spots. Yeah, he's measuring something. Um, awesome Man says they are also very hard to feed. They only eat certain types of gum leaves. And I don't know if y'all were here the other night when I was talking about some people trying to help koalas or actually drowning them because koalas are used to. Uh, that they're, is they're, not me. I know. That's. <laughs> no, I just, I just trying to figure out what the sound was. And I figured out what it was. Um, and, and he says. Uh, despite all the pictures you see, they bite. But they also, so, sadly, people are accidentally drowning koalas because they're trying to pour water in their mouth and they're used to sucking moisture off of the leaves and out of things. And they're not used to having a flow of something to drink from. And plus they're looking up to drink out of the bottle and it, some of them have drowned. He said, I hate to admit it, six years ago, 4th of July outdoor party consumed 10 long ones through the evening, got up to go for nature, wound up on my... But and hearing aid came out. Is everybody drinking tonight? What is up? <laughs> <laughs> my God, if he drank 10 Long Island teas, by God, I'm surprised he could get up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break up the, uh, I don't know either, John. Russ, I'm, I mean Wes, Dag Nevit. I was gonna tell you, it's not me, y'all. <laughs> I better go get something out of the shop and be right back, so I have a toy to play with. Well, no, because I already have enough sound effects. <laughs> 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 Good golly! Here's my paint pens. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I'm almost done. I'll quit making noise. Till the cats walk in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. And uh, Wooden says, was it one of those for everyone? Naves, John Naves says, you feel the alcohol more when you're in a hot tub? I don't know. I haven't touched alcohol in many, many years. I don't know, but beer in the shower is an awesome, awesome thing. I've been seeing a lot of that on Facebook lately. I was bearing in the shower before bearing in the shower was a thing. By God, you was cool before cool was cool. <laughs> <laughs> this thing, I've, I've been drinking. <laughs> I've been drinking Snapple tea, fellas, with absolutely nothing else in it. I'm drinking straight Dr. Pepper. Apparently, I need to... Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I saw that photo of uh, Shire photo, Shire beer photo of uh, Sterling. Jamie and, and Julian. Jamie and, and uh, Julian in the tub, and I named them small, medium, and freakishly large. <laughs> Sterling was a large one. Julian was a little midget. <laughs> uh oh. I almost feel like I'm running the romper room here. <laughs> <laughs> but Charles, I'm doing my best. Stop eating the paste. <laughs> <laughs> that was very good. Thank you. I know what's getting to me. It's not 
the margarita, it's the dead gum clear coat fumes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Where is Lee Niden when I need him? I'm almost afraid to ask, why do you need him? <laughs> <laughs> At least he would keep us on track. I'm, I'm, I'm staying on track here. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't a dig on Lee Knight, and I just didn't know what how that. Dennis says, uh, sorry, can't spell. Was it one of those days for everyone, so everyone started drinking? No clue, sir. That sounds like a lion. That's not a lion. It's a standard. Yeah. <laughs> tickets. Tickets, please. Oh, yeah. now, some of these shadows are kind of subtle, but they're there. But so I might as well add them. Oh. Hallelujah. Wes, did you just step on a dog? No, it's a cat. <laughs> Who's your mic? Y'all are hilarious. I think this time I'm I think this one time I'm innocent. <laughs> <laughs> well, same to you, Lawrence. Appreciate you being here, sir. Good night, Lawrence. Right. <laughs> <Hey. clears throat> I almost, I almost wouldn't be surprised if this one got help to review. <laughs> it wasn't what I was going for. But... <laughs> Did the other one get held? No, I didn't think I, so. I thought I, we made it good on that one. I have lost two subscribers since this started. <laughs> this one? Yeah. But well, it ain't me then. <laughs> 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 it, ain't, it ain't me. <laughs> tickets, tickets, please. <laughs> okay, we have soot and shadows on here, but, uh, so we're just gonna draw what we see, and, and that's that. This half of the patterns can be pretty easy compared to the koala, in my opinion. I know what you should do when you have the soot and the shadows. On the shadows, you draw them dark, dark lines, and then you know that's a shadow. When well, you get to the to the soot area, just go uh, draw them lighter. You can't draw them lighter. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Yeah, uh, that's cool. I'm I'm just gonna say the same thing I see. Some of it's gonna look like little scribbles, splotches. That's gonna be the slit, and everything else is gonna be shadows. <sighs> My, um, I love how we have each other's back. <laughs> Mike says, "Old man says good night, Lawrence." Now there's some soot inside these shadows, but I can only do one or the other, so I'm just gonna blah blah bull stink. Oh, just go ahead and cut the shadow and leave the soot. <laughs> that, that poor cat. That poor cat is catching all heck. Y'all, y'all would know if I stepped on the cat because she's going to turn around and jump up and slap me right in the face. <laughs> put him on camera. Go ahead, put him back on camera so we can see that. This. <laughs> <laughs> this little cat is meaner than a junkyard dog. Hmm. And she, she puts on a good show because she comes up and she's like, oh, I want you to pay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dennis said, I almost got you. I said, I did. I tried. Randy Bosheen's back in the house. Hello, Hello Randy. Randy. Welcome back, Mr. Randy. Y'all are catching the one of the few times I'm trying to remain mature. <laughs> you know, it's like I'm starting to feel like a stay-at-home mom. <laughs> <laughs> now not a whole lot of smudges but there are some so I want to include them
<sighs> okay, these are definitely soot smudges. Hello, Herb. <laughs> we go from chaos to total dead silence. <laughs> there ain't nothing doing but watching a, a paint. Uh, pen move on to paper. Yeah, Nobody sure. was saying nothing. Why? Well, because I didn't know what there to was, teach because I figured, I figured it was obvious what I was doing, but go ahead. It was just me being mature. Oh, cool. And there's the cat. There's the cat. Good thing my dog is taking, take, taking a swat at me. <laughs> Get lost. <laughs> now this weird shadow on his nose looks like he has a huge nostril, but that's not the case. It's just it's really his eyebrow and forehead and nose are the only things sticking out as far as his face goes. <laughs> is he squeezing the cat? <laughs> the cat's name is not Penelope. You won't get no <laughs> chocolate pellets. <laughs> that That is just her walking by trying to uh, take my head off. She's mad at you for going out on that date. Leaving her there. <laughs> yeah. Either uh -huh. either mad that you went on or the mad you came back early, one of the two. Yeah. <laughs> 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 then it's something we're like the walk and hello everyone. Hello, John boy. Yeah. Charles couldn't say that to us because he'd say hello, Wes and Wes, and, or Russ and Russ. I, I was speaking to say, yeah. Charles, Charles would be done real quick because he's just going to say good night, Wes. <laughs> and that would mean to both of us. <laughs> oh, yeah. And twofer. We, we got we, a twofer out of it. We come back in the morning, Russ will still be here trying to find the camera to point at it. <laughs> <laughs> that sucker had to zing me, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, every now and I'm pointing right now, by God. <laughs> no, you're pointing, right. off, you're, po pointing. you're pointing off to your left, actually. I know it. <laughs> she, she wanted something to drink. She's about to get something to drink. Hit her upside the head with this Pepsi bottle. Oh. But now she's laying down beside me playing cool, like roll over. Please pet my belly. No, I ain't following for that trick. <laughs> I had some place to go with that, but I ain't saying it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hold that one back. Just like when a woman says no comment, <laughs> you can hear you just say. I did. Oh, oh. And I can say that because I was married to one for 10 years. My sister's one. Uh, I kind of know that feeling. John, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you, John. And thank you, Russ, for reading that out loud. Uh, well, I'm trying to read you the comments, man. That's, that's my job. <laughs> I, 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 I can't grab by you for that. <laughs> that's why you pay me the big bucks. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no cats were hurt on this live stream. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> but you can't tell it by the noise you're hearing. It sounds like it's, it's biting our ear. That's her biting my ear. <laughs> well, you sound like a cat when she bites you. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going to have to be locked up after this. That's what I do with my dogs. I had to lock them out. They, they were making too much noise. I noticed I didn't hear that anymore. Cow going to take me away. <laughs> <laughs> to the funny farm. Ooh. I love you too, Charles. Let's see, I was dealing with the shadows of that strap, and now the strap is black too, so I got to do a little bit of separation in there. I don't necessarily have to, but I'm going to. Y'all heard it here. That's abusing his cat. <laughs> Shoot, I'm the one getting abused. You might have to call the ASPCA on him. Something. I wish somebody would. I have two very, very loving cats that need a good home. <laughs> you know, we, we can hear how loving they are, all that praising you. <laughs> yeah. that's, not, that's not a good selling point, all that noise we're hearing. <laughs> Thank God I live two hours away from it. <laughs> it has a smile on his face while it's torturing you. <laughs> hey, Ru hey Ru you're coming to the Houston show, ain't you? I am. <laughs> All right. Don't bring them. Oh, um, <laughs> Don't I'll, bring them. I'll have them boxed up. <laughs> <laughs> no, sir. Oh, that gives me a reason to have something else to do that day. <laughs> there goes the train now. <laughs> Well, I missed something, Chris says. Sounds like a what? <laughs> What's that icon, man? Sounds uh, like a party. Is that what that that's, is? That's a confetti something. Ah, jeez. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And everyone took a drink. Everyone is so quiet. <laughs> The men in the white coats are here to take you away. That's a, that's a West, right? Probably. I shouldn't have read that comment. That was his comment to read. <laughs> tickets. Everybody got their tickets. <laughs> Next stop, the Looney Farm. No, Charles is just being mature for once, Frankie. <laughs> no, no, no. Charles is waiting on the cat again. <laughs> I'm sitting right here. I got doing my thing. <laughs> ah. Okay. Hold on. <sighs> I'm back to normal now. What is normal? Oh, don't start. <laughs> I have to lay down on the couch and think <laughs> about it. <laughs> what is normal? I got a dog crying at the gate to get in this room. That's my normal. I Man, got a cat trying up. to send me out the gate. <laughs> <laughs> Yours wants you to leave. Mine wants to come in. I'm going to go get her. See, Wes, Ru Russ mutes when he's making noise. Everybody muted now. I just spoke too soon. <laughs> you want me to mute? All right. By golly. <laughs> <laughs> Charles Mature, take two drinks. <laughs> That's funny, right? Well, this is, one, this is one of my rare moments. And we all have those. Ouch! Good gut on a stick, man. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, <laughs> wow, sorry. I got back in time to hear that. What was that? <laughs> well, probably karma in the, form of a, in the form of a cat. Oh, right on uh, the freaking toe. Don't bring them cats to Houston. <laughs> oh, they, they're very, very loving. 
as Hal 2000 said, I can't do that, Dave. <laughs> I remember that. Show. It's funny how we go from chaos, chaos, chaos to dead, <laughs> dead silence, huh? See, it works better when I don't talk. There goes that, that, that thing, uh, tape measure again. No, that's me crying. <laughs> oh. My toe is bleeding. <laughs> what in the situation? Was that? He said, Do you need the medics? <laughs> There's blood on my toe. God, oh. dog, that hurt too, by the way. Oh, cat bite, boy. You might have to go to ER for that. Hey, I'm gonna have what? What's that funky virus going around? <laughs> well, I hope it ain't that one. <laughs> Budweiser virus. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. And now Wes is silent. Did the cat kill him? Not yet. No. Not she yet. Got close. She did take the other foot right to the the head, Shiloh. <laughs> That's either a good thing or a bad thing. Uh, she either proved her dominance. Or she's going to get back up. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's just creeping around the corner waiting to pounce on me again. <laughs> That's one of the meanest little cats I've ever seen in my life. Was she a stray cat that you picked up or something? You, what? No, I've had the stupid thing for five years. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm a glutton for punishment. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, but I had the wife for 10, so which is better? Redheaded the wife or the redheaded cat? <laughs> Seems like there's the a common cat. denominator here. <laughs> you, like, you like the color red. <laughs> Yeah, when I was younger, praying that I could be surrounded by women, I wasn't specific, so I ended up with a biological daughter and a stepdaughter, <laughs> two stepdaughters. <laughs> Only man in the house, huh? <laughs> yeah, that wasn't the way I meant it, and all the cats are females. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. Know the feeling. Before we got our our smallest dog, youngest dog, I was the only guy in the house for a long time. And you got in trouble for being the in the dogs. Car. The dogs were female. The wife is female. I had my daughter here. She's female. So I, I had all kind of females until we got that little puppy. And by God, he's he's the meanest out of the bunch sometimes. And, and you're the only one that gets in trouble for peeing in the corner. <laughs> no. <laughs> You don't get in trouble I, for it? I don't get in trouble for it. <laughs> I blame it on him. <laughs> your Mike says, I haven't even taken a nap here. Y'all are keeping me awake. LOL. <laughs> well, I'm so sorry. <laughs> well, while we've all been cutting up, I'm almost done with the left half here. Sort of. I mean, I've still got the wrinkles down here. But, yeah. Now, you see, he would have. He would have been done sooner, but he is triple stack in this pattern, so it's a little slower than normal. <laughs> and make sure you draw those lines a little bit lighter. <laughs> I tried that one already. <laughs> uh, uh, just reminded, don't go too dark. Hmm. Well, with triple stacking, he's got to push it down a little bit more. I'm, I'm going to get that little light that says, you've been removed from the show. <laughs> <laughs> Darn the luck. <laughs> what happened? Are you saying you've gotten that light before? <laughs> I didn't know there was a light. <laughs> My God, now that he does, he's going to look for it. <laughs> if I knew that was there, you would have been done long ago. <laughs> <laughs> I know you can either kick somebody from the current, you can either kick somebody out or ban them. 
Um, that's on the panel. We haven't gotten there yet. <laughs> okay. But the night is young. <laughs> Man, you almost finished. Sort of. Are you playing in the litter box, Wes? No, that's, that's me. me. My dog. My <laughs> dog is doing that. <laughs> She's got a little doggy bed down there. She's got to clean it so she can lay in it. Yeah. You know, every one of them, have to, both dogs come clean. I said, that thing is clean enough. Lay down. <clears throat> now this right here is a piece of tape, so that's not shadow. That's just the tape. Stop. So is that a lighter or a darker line? All the same, Sparky. <laughs> <laughs> Remember. Don't cross the line. Nobody got any questions. Nobody got any questions out there. There's your mic says, I love the sound effects tonight. And that makes one of us. <laughs> <laughs> tickets. Get your tickets out. All aboard. <laughs> Which one of them earlier is that? Choo-choo. Hashtag choo-choo. There you go. <laughs> All aboard. <laughs> Hold on to it, Charles. Hold on to it. I, I, think, I, I think I need a mite all. <laughs> Chris, unless I kill myself, uh, Chris Nealon, yes, it will be. <laughs> Uh, Chris Nealon's asking uh, if this pattern will be on the site in the morning. Sometime tomorrow, or depending on uh, if my web guy, Mr. Steve Nealon, is awake or not. Uh, if, he's being, if he's anything like me right now, he's probably wishing he was asleep. I'm surprised he not he's not adding to the chaos. The chat's actually behaving better than the dang panel tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Next stop, Funny Farm. Hashtag last call for the Funny Farm. <laughs> It's usually the chat we have to get under control. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Josh Grover's gone. <laughs> <laughs> He's the one that comes up with the most of them. Yep. All aboard for Syracuse. <laughs> oh. Actually, some of the details not even showing. I'm kind of having to make it up because I know they have fuzzy ears. <laughs> not the funny farm. They have a restraining order against them. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's when you know you have issues. <laughs> they can't have Wes in there. They don't allow cats. <laughs> Yep, got one cat that's blonde, the other one's redhead. Oh, how do you know she's blonde? Because she's mellow yellow. The other one is not at all. <laughs> I swear one of my cats has special needs. I don't know how to prove it. you got to give examples, Charles. Uh, every, <laughs> all day, every day. <laughs> <clears throat> You're talking about your little blonde one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
and Wes or Russ has a crick in his neck again. I yeah. never started calling him Wes until both y'all are in the room. I don't know what's up with that. I don't either. To tell you the truth. I've never thought that them two names sound the same. Me either. Everybody that I know tells me that it, it, they call me the other. Every every one of them. I never did that until both of y'all were in the in the panel. That's that's, that's what's weird about it. <laughs> it's actually a slight advantage that this koala koala is slightly blurry. It forces me to generalize the detail rather than get real nitpicky with it. Which makes it easier on the average scroller. Well, I hope people take the charity idea more seriously than they are the slide feed. <laughs> mm. Okay, this half is not done. I was about to say done, but more of the top. Go ahead and turn your head completely sideways there, Russ. I'm just about doing it, too, by God. I'm trying to see where your line was drawn. Now we're done with this half. The other half should go much quicker because it's only this wide. Should go quicker. So I think in, in the scheme of things, this is a relatively easy pattern. So hopefully it will appeal to the masses, not for my popularity, but for the sake of donating to the Australian charities, which is why we're doing this pattern. That is a good picture. I, I, I really like that one. Probably best out of the ones I've seen. Yeah, thanks to Mr. Austin and Bill. Mm -hmm. I mean, the symbolism is better in my opinion, but you know, I mean, there's oh, most of the other designs out there are koalas, which are cute. So I, I mean, nothing against that. But it's symbolism oh, no. you know, having the firefighter kind of. Yeah. You know, we had uh, three American firefighters that got killed over there. I did not know that. Yeah, helping to fight the fires. So I, th I think two. I, th I think it's three, but it might have been two. But I think it's three firefighters passed over there. My God, you can tell it. And it looks a little chaotic over here because we don't. We're not seeing the whole. What you call it? What you call it? Being a koala. And I gotta get another clean sheet of paper out. Randy said he finished cutting the eagle and flag pattern tonight. Cool. Very cool. And Randy Bosheen says, can't be a Charles Daring pattern if it's easy. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, you know, this might appeal to more people being that it's somewhat easy. In my opinion, it's easy. I might be a little biased. Yeah, it's a lot. It, it's a lot easier than some of yours, by God. Yeah. Can be done during the same day, hopefully.
Yep. <laughs> yeah, no, it is quiet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not much you can say about tape sticking up. <laughs> no. Well, um, tape tree is in unless, the house. Unless you <laughs> use it to tape your eyelids open. Well, Dale, <laughs> Dale, if you're drunk, you're welcome to join because it seems to be the fitting thing. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I would prefer sober, but you know, whatever the case may be. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how he can call him drunk. Man's only had one drink. Never mind that it was the size of a barrel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's getting up for work. Oh, so it's about 5 a.m. there, I believe. <sighs> Five, close to 5.30 a.m. Yeah. Sure. Appreciate you stopping by, Dale. It's been a while. I'm starting to wonder if all y'all were upset with me or something. Sticking head around the door. <laughs> well, Dennis said he started cutting his new project today and had to stop. Everything went wrong, so he came to watch the master. Well, I'm sorry that I, I should open this place, <laughs> but I appreciate it. Yeah, he was supposed to be here, but I had to take over for him. He called, stand in, stand in. By the way, y'all check out my first studios on Sundays. He does live streams out of the UK, 3 p.m. his time. I believe it's 8 or 9 a.m. Central. I caught some of his uh, cutting of uh, David Bowie Very today. Good. I think it was today. This morning. No, no, I'm not lying on the floor, Mr. Dale. That was that was so old. That's, uh, <laughs> that's old news. We've moved on since <laughs> <laughs> But he almost hit the floor last night. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, we, lo we lost our crap. Now, that was this morning, wasn't it? Way early this morning. See, now just when I think things are going to calm down, somebody in the chat wants to get it going again by making a kind of ticket. <laughs> 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 they, they love it when we derail. The one time I'm trying to be mature here. <laughs> oh. Rare though it is. All aboard. Tickets, please. <laughs> Tickets, please. <laughs> well, one thing I can say is I don't think this this pattern will be chaotic, so that's the good side of all this. Dale asked uh, do koala bears move. Here we go. Uh, for what it's worth, they're not bears. <laughs> they're uh, mercer mercer mercerpials. 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 <laughs> Hashtag. Choo -choo. <clears throat> That's technically cho-cho, but okay. I know, but I, I paraphrased. Yes, sir. Or ad-libbed. However you want to be. So, <laughs> I want to be a real boy. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome that says they growl. Just can't see one of them cute little things growling. They sound like this. Know. Ah! <laughs> he just he just he just twist he just twist the cat's tail or something. All I did was John. poke. Oh, I just poked her in the head. <laughs> She's gonna go get a big club for him. <laughs> oh my goodness! Uh, I shouldn't have poked her in the head. Fight on again. <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember who was the one with the blood on his body. <laughs> you better watch it. The bloody toad, dead gummit. <sighs> I'm tired now. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, go! She's coming. coming. She's she's coming back for more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that gives me shades of Ted Nugent there, John. <laughs> Hashtag cat scratch is a coming. 
Good scratch fever. Yeah, baby. Awesome. I had that too at a young age. Yeah, well, I've, I've been lucky enough to get keep away from that. Bill no, says, the, uh, I, only I, look I not that one. Oh. <laughs> I, I had the <laughs> real catch scratch fever. Oh, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah Russ, Russ, Russ I was been, don't don't spin, fight him. <laughs> Russ has been trying too. to read Russ's, uh, uh, Bill's comment for 30 minutes now. <laughs> <laughs> I spent I two and a half weeks in the <laughs> hospital with that junk. Yeah, that is not fun. But yes, I've been lucky enough to stay away from that too. Um, Aussie man says they only look cute. They can inflict nasty bites and deep scratches. By God, if I couldn't read it, that I knew Charles would take it. <laughs> well, you, 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 you tried. I'll give you that. Yeah, I did. <laughs> no, I lost him anyway. They left me. Yep, lost the chat. Oh, you did too? Well, good. It's yep. not just me. No, Every didn't. once in a while, it just boots us off. It'll come back in a minute. I can see the private chat, but not the public chat. Is there something in the private chat? No, you never talk to us. Well, I'm usually, you know, actually working here. <laughs> Wes, do we need to give you and the cat a moment together? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've had plenty of moments this evening. I wish you'd say, go away. Shut yeah, the will. door or, or draw the curtain one because you need a moment. <laughs> Welcome to the funny farm. Huh? <laughs> Hello, uh, Steve Nealon. Uh, help me. <laughs> <laughs> What's really bad is when you're laying in bed sleeping and she walks up and bites you on the nose. Well, that's, ah. when I, that's when I keep the door closed. Because last I've seen, cats don't have opposable thumbs. Oh, this one can <laughs> open doors. Wow. Yeah. There's no such thing as closed doors at my house with this little munchkin. I'm trying to picture that in my mind. She has to jump up on that doorknob and just grab it and let it fall, huh? I don't. I, I'm usually on the other <laughs> side, so I don't see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to picture how she can do it. Charles, get that picture out of my mind. Uh. <laughs> 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 no clue what to do there. Yeah, no help at all. Uh, nope. <sighs> and John Nave says that was good, Charles. I don't even know what he's what he's referring. That was to. further back, man. When you were reading the comment, I think. I don't know. It's been too long. I need a drink. <laughs> <laughs> a stiff drink. My God, if you were a drinking man, I'd believe it. Let me share. I might start tonight, by God. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Get that bag clean. She did. She laid down. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised y'all can hear that. That really ain't that loud. No, it's not yeah. loud. It's just, you know, when there's dead quiet. Huh. John says, now nah, I'm picturing Oh, cat from Pet Cemetery. Cemetery. <laughs> That was a heck, of a heck of a movie, and, and, I, and the she, book was she even does better. Act like a, like a, a lot like church. A zombie cat? Yep. Oh, Winston Churchill. <laughs> Isn't that right, you little jerk? 
Yeah. And she said, yes, too, by gosh. And she swatted at my face. <laughs> <laughs> that boy's a glutton for punishment, you know that? He ain't going to win. <laughs> she, she's only doing what I'm telepathically telling her to do. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, Dale, Dale has got to leave, but uh, bacon rolls, coffee, and donuts, I can do for some of that. Appreciate you dropping by, Mr. Dale. Started to think y'all didn't like me anymore. If you're still here, that was a real good uh, David Bowie you did. I, I liked it. If you're gone, I'll catch you next time. And he still liked it. And I did. <laughs> it was in his uh, Ziggy stage. Yeah. Wes, are you working on paper dolls or something? Something, something like that. Okay. I'm just wondering why he needs that tape tape measure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. Ah! I'm done with the tape measure. <laughs> that was a short measurement. No, I'm done. <laughs> Don't go there. <laughs> uh, I, I didn't take it there. Yeah, uh, he says, Who's your Mike says the babysit a seven month old golden retriever and he lets himself in the patio door. We have those lever style handles. I can see that a lot easier. Yeah. That's the first thing I thought of when Wes said that. Well, I tell you what, when when we meet up in Houston. I'll have that little box ready for you, <laughs> and and you'll see for yourself. And replace the doorknobs. <laughs> yeah, uh, there you go. I'll even include your first set of door handles. <laughs> Man, you know my wife had cats, but she turned out she's allergic to them. She had cats all all her, all her life, and uh, she's allergic to them now. So we don't have any more. There were two these, here when I married are, her. These are hybrid, so you don't have to worry about allergies. Charles? Wow. Did they go to a special school or something? <laughs> I think his man is full of crap. <laughs> <laughs> Two nicest cats you'll ever be around in your life. They're hybrid. They don't shed. Ouch. They don't. Yeah, they don't. They know how to box. They're, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it trips me out, though, because they're sisters. And one is mm -hmm. just super laid back, love you all the time. And the other one will rip your head off just for looking wow. at her. <laughs> God dang. <laughs> no. I, that sounds like one of the, the first uh, Shih Tzus that we had. We went to one of those uh, puppy mills over there in Louisiana. And uh, I picked a dog on dog out when he was a puppy. He was the quietest puppy there. Every other one was just barking their tails off. And he was the quietest one. So I picked him, got him home, and he was a biter from the word go. <laughs> and uh, he was, he was oh, um, um, no, he just was a biter. And, uh, you know, we, he grew up. And he became a mama's dog to a real hard degree. I mean, where I'm at is in a parent's retreat off the master bedroom. She could be laying in the bed. He'd be up there with her. And if I turned around and faced that bed and he seen me, he would immediately jump to the corner of that bed closest to me and start barking his tail off just for looking. Get away from my mama. That's exactly what, and he bit everybody in the house. He was a mean little son of a gun. Boy, he was mean. But he was a, or she, he was a she, she dog. It was She was pretty, that was a pretty dog. But she was the meanest, rottenest thing you could ever see. 
<laughs> Sounds kind of like what that one is. You couldn't look at this dog. Only time you could touch his or her collar is to uh, put a put a, a, a leash on her to take her outside to go to the bathroom. Anything else? It was a struggle not to get bit. It was she was just a crazy, crazy dog. She, well, she was pretty. She was dog. pretty enough to put on the cover of a dog magazine. That dog was pretty. And pretty mean. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag boxing kitty. That's exactly right, John. She'll stand on her hind feet and box at you. Well, see, he says it's hybrid. I think it's uh it don't shed because it's it's got the the uh the skin and the body of a robot. <laughs> That's why I don't shed. My God, is a robot cat. <laughs> that voice is on tape, man. <laughs> Hashtag robot boxing kitties. All right. <clears throat> and you're about to wrap it up, Charles. It didn't go as long quick as you thought it would. <laughs> you thought it would? Yes, sir. Because there's not a whole lot of Uber detail. It's mainly general detail. But hopefully the easiness will appeal to people. Right. My ink's trying to run out on this dang pen. <laughs> Dot com. <sighs> Not paper break. <clears throat> Terminator kitty. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Robot body. I should have said Terminator cat. I didn't think about that one. Good one, John. <clears throat> Robo kitty. Yes. That's another good one. You're coming with meow. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> the one time I tried to be funny and I bombed it. Okay. I don't know. If she's not redheaded, she's bipolar for sure. <laughs> <laughs> you know i went to that uh last one in houston that woodworking show and uh i got there on it was a saturday that i went and uh i get to the place and i forgot to bring cash with me and so i i tried to go in and they they wouldn't take a credit card you had to have cash. So I said, uh, is there an ATM nearby? So they said probably at the front. So I went to the front and they said, no, <laughs> we don't have an ATM. So, oh, crap. So uh, I said, I just walked back down. I said, well, I'll look in for a minute because I, I ain't be able to get in. And uh, them girls let me in for free, which is mighty nice of them. That's cool. Yeah. I, I was almost didn't get to see y'all there. Tag Navy. By God. Uh, they Dennis felt sorry says, for me. Dennis says he has to go. Appreciate you being here. Uh, Hi, Dennis. Aussie man says details. Scroller man details. Makes a better project. I'm going with every detail I can find. By God. Well, I, I was given every other weekend and holiday visitation with that sunflower, Russ. So if you're at Houston, I will have it at the show with me on display. 
cool. <laughs> yeah. I, I didn't know what that meant at first. And then he was, I realized he was being literal with his art and treasure piece. <laughs> Weekend visitation. <laughs> well, I don't know how, how y'all made us unblower. I'm sorry. <laughs> you saw it. <laughs> That was awful nice of her to give me every other weekend. <laughs> I was sad to see it go, but it went to a very good home. The bank? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't make any money on that project. Well, then you did it wrong. I'm just kidding. Oh, no, I didn't do it wrong. <laughs> I did very good with that project. No, I was trying to be funny. <laughs> Well, how did you not make any money off it? They didn't pay for it, genius. <laughs> <laughs> he made other arrangements, Charles. He can't broadcast that. There you go. That. There you go. <laughs> <All right. laughs> I didn't know it was a, a, an ongoing secret. <laughs> <laughs> Some things are better oh, left unsaid. Yeah. Well, then why do y'all constantly... <laughs> 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 sometimes you make money and sometimes you make friends there you go I have trouble making both <laughs> <laughs> so do I but by god I made a friend out of this one <laughs> is it your one date night anything related there yeah that's the one yeah no wonder it didn't cost him. It didn't cost him money anyway. I just want your soul for the next 10 years. Man, we got to go 11. I got to I got to at least do better than the first. My first one <laughs> 3 years. Bill's asking if you did the flames on the tree. He can't see the lines. I did everything around because you can't really add lines to flames. I did all He'd the all the detail around him. He drew yeah. those lines real light. <laughs> <laughs> I, get, I, get what you're, I get what you're saying there, Bill, but I mean, really, there's no way to do the detail of the flames because there's not much detail there. But yeah, I, I, I did the detail around him. Yeah. So as far as a pattern, it may not look like fire but uh it'll look like a, a guy holding a koala so we got that going for us <laughs> hopefully it'll look like a koala and not a drunk cat but hashtag uh, drunk kitty <laughs> john's gotta go to bed uh get up a little over four hours good night john good night sir appreciate you joining i keep thinking the same thing send help thank god i'm retired yeah. i don't have to worry about getting up early in the morning Hopefully you'll see us all tomorrow. And uh, appreciate you being here. It's my weekend to play daddy, so I probably won't be out much. And that's okay. It's my weekend to play yes, daddy. I'm just kidding. Wouldn't that be ironic if I died? Anyway. Oh. Well, I don't want it to happen. I'm just saying it would be ironic. <laughs> See if we can't make us a scroll soft pattern here. All right. I think I would take uh, some uh, some uh, orange paint, mm -hmm. neon orange possibly, or putting the brown in it, and uh, try to paint the flames that you had there after it gets cut. Yep. Kind of show it, show it off, make it, make it look right. I get up time is when I feel like it. That's right, yeah, Bill. That's right. That's a wonderful feeling, buddy. It usually takes me a few minutes to feel like getting up. <laughs> yeah, I can go to bed when I want, get up when I want. I love it. Worked a long time to get there. Am I screen sharing? Yes. Oh. oh, let me put my face back on. <laughs> <laughs> I 
All right, well, I'll just get like you. I don't have a little icon. You can get me one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I only turn it back on when I'm pointing at the camera. See, it's pointing crooked. God dang it. I like doing this. Watch, watch. <laughs> God only knows what y'all are doing over there. <laughs> you can't see. <laughs> oh. oh man, that's freaky. It's almost the same look. What the hell are y'all doing? <laughs> Muddy. <laughs> God. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm about to owe you an upside the head. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to see you take the first oh. punch, my God, and see if you can reach that far. <laughs> oh yeah. <clears throat> I got the feeling that this is gonna be outstanding well thank you sir i hope it is because i actually didn't struggle much with this one which means it went too well I'm waiting for the other shooter drop <laughs> there is that half full or half empty huh it is but yeah uh, sadly oh man uh -oh. i just realized i left out the tree behind the firefighter on the far left yeah that's not that much. You could put that in if you wanted to. Yeah. Yep. But then again, it does put more focus on the koala bear in the front of the firefighter in the back. But yeah, I, I missed that. So now, again, there was really no way to make the fire stand out. There's something coloring can do. Right. But I don't know that I could have done anything to help. <sighs> okay. I don't need to make some noise or something. <laughs> I'm I'll, helping you look for lines. <laughs> but you moved them too quick. I was griping earlier about the, all the noise y'all were making. Now y'all aren't making enough. <laughs> Seems like Bill liked your uh, Freddy Krueger looks. There, Wes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Straight out of his nightmares. That makes Freddy Krueger look good. Kind of did. The first one, I thought, man, that the guy go uh, Jack Nicholson. I said, ah, in his shining. <laughs> Here's Johnny. <laughs> oh, uh, I bet you all saw a pattern from that, by the way. I know you did. I think that's one of them I do have. I don't know. Maybe. That's pretty recent. Maybe I don't have it then. Maybe I don't. <laughs> Maybe I don't care. That's a song. Oh, yeah. Mm Is your dog snoring? Yeah. Okay. Man, you can hear that? <laughs> yeah. Wow. My dad's dog <laughs> snores, so I've, okay. I mean, oh, is she's, hearing anything? Yeah, she's a hard snorer. I can hear it now. now, now oh, you have to listen real hard to hear it, by God. It's like you hear it, and then, it's, you, then you can't ignore it. It's like, 
<laughs> she snores hard. <laughs> like so. a Tyrannosaurus Rex laying there. <laughs> She's a little bitty thing, but by God, she can merely belt out them snores. There you go. <laughs> like you, you can't ignore it. Now that you, now All that right, listen. come on. I'll put that mute on. Shoot. <laughs> no, I'm just saying now that, now that we've brought it up, you can't ignore it. Bill's saying he's having trouble seeing the bear. It ain't there yet. That's not a bear. part of it. Well, he's it's going, not a bear. He's going across two pieces, too, so it's uh, hard to see him until he's until we put it all together. Somewhere in there, if I can line it up right. Oh, there it is. You sure? I think <laughs> you need to take two <laughs> steps back. <laughs> After you take one step forward. You know, I forget to try something. Gag blab it. <laughs> what did I do? It's not lined up. Something's not lined up somewhere. I got to figure out what that is. Let me. You was close, but you're still off a little bit. Something. Okay, there's where we're going. Right here. Uh, but I did forget to trace the rest of that shadow in there, but that's okay. I can I can wing that. Yeah. Bill, are you still having trouble seeing the bear? <laughs> <laughs> Not a whole lot to go off of right this second. <laughs> There you go. Now we're firing on all cylinders. Right now we're co connecting broken little lines because this time they con they connected on the sides rather than top and bottom. Yeah, I need to draw in, draw in the shadow of the the uh, firefighter's wrinkle in his jacket. It's nothing major, but. I'm going to throw it in there. And I'll round it up here in a second. <laughs> he said he is still having trouble. We all are right now. But it's going to uh, magically appear. Well. Not God, he's got his tape measure out. He'll find it for you. There's an eyeball. Yep. There's where the fire was. Yep. Right in there. Right there. Yep. Point at it. You can't see me, but I am. I'm afraid to see if you're actually pointing at it. I was. <laughs> and it was straight, too, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot to crop it. Is that a cat or you, Wes? <laughs> well, like you have to make those bodily things. You have to put the mood on. Yeah. <laughs> Sounded like one of those things they call a death rattle. <laughs> uh, that was my attempt to snore. Uh, <laughs> sound more like Big Bird. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> Organize.
Now hold the noise down. I'm trying to give you all the room you can to concentrate, buddy. You're <laughs> 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 doing a delicate surgery here, people. Yes, yeah, I'm looking real, real close too. <laughs> Charles during his life making the John Wayne pattern. Not anymore. <laughs> I'm just now getting notified. <laughs> well, I didn't you know YouTube was on top of it. Uh oh. Who's your mic? Sorry, Charles. Just had a Reese's cup. Oh my God. That's my thing. That's all right. I've been having. Chips and dip tonight. I can almost see the bear now. <laughs> well, it, you know, I'm sitting here saying, you know, I think this was actually going to turn out good. If it ends up not looking like a bear in his arms, then then I have failed. But let's hope. I uh, I can see I can see the bear now. If you hurry up and get all that gray filled in, he won't look so bare. I know. <laughs> I okay. see what you did there. You have not been paying attention. It is not a bear. <laughs> I have said that multiple times. <laughs> Well, why do they call it a koala bear then? Because they're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> A marsupial koala bear. It looks like a bear, but it's not a bear. Isn't a panda bear not really a bear also? God, if I know. I was looking for pictures of uh, koala bears or koalas, and one of the things said, uh, a lot of people call them koala bears, but they're not bears. They just look like bears. Can I ask what you're doing with your little zigzaggy thing there? Because when I do that, it's because my mouse went dead and I'm trying to fix I'm the battery. Color, <laughs> color replacer. I'm uh, uh, the over here on the right side where my mouse is. The right side is the color it is. That's the color we want it to be. So I'm right clicking the color that it is and making it the color I want it to be. And we may have to do it the. Somebody's writing to me on Messenger, and I can't do a dang thing about it. Uh, da, da, let me get the areas I know I want to color in first. Make sure we got this the way we want it, and I'll do it the quick way. And we can... Uh, let me save this. old-fashioned way or my up you know what I mean that was intentional don't scream
so other than the tree over his shoulder or this is this, this is the scroll file pattern <laughs> there you are folks for the for the purposes of uh bill can you point out his other eyeball whose other eyeball <laughs> the koalas yeah just say let me uh because I see one in the nose, and the other one is a little hard to see. The other eyeball is... Right there. Yeah, there you are, folks. Well, that's not it. Is that the... Oh, no, wait. Is that the... Oh, yeah, that is the full-size pattern. Just wanted to make sure. Yeah, right, right, uh, right there is his other eye. Now I can squeeze the hair, the detail under the eye to make it look more round. But it's also going along the bridge of his nose. Okay. That's why it wasn't perfectly round. So let me round that off and it'll look more like an eye. So there's his nose. There's one eye and there's the other eye. Okay, folks. And we're going to do the wood grain version just to make it pop a little more. Hoody doody do. Also, now I see your old Blinky Bill. Blinky Bill. That's what he says. I'm confuzzled. And I didn't make a border at the top because I'm a dork stick, but you get the idea. Whoops. I didn't crop it correctly, but you get the idea, hopefully. Dang it. And there she be. Almost. Just about. There you go. I see there. Now you can tell. <laughs> Blinky Bill is I'll, a cartoon character in Australia. I can see the bear. I can see the bear. And I, was I can see the bear that's not a bear. The bear that is not there. That's not a line. That's a stand-up. <laughs> I know. Was I subtle <laughs> enough with that? Could you tell it was me talking? Yes, because yeah. it wasn't me. Well, hopefully that appeals to somebody. And uh, there, there is your. As soon as I can get on the website, it will be available for sale and all every ounce of the proceeds. And I, you asked about the fire. There was only some, I, I did all the detail between all the fires. So I don't, I don't, I truly, sincerely do not know how to make it look more like fire. The only way to do it is, is to, is to color. Uh, have color it in. If you have the original photo, you can see it. It's in a couple places. Yeah. And you can just color it Somebody in. Somebody that, uh, there, there was a posting in one of the groups. They had taken the picture frame and threw it in a fire pit so they could do the same with the cutting and create the fire here. Well, <laughs> I don't know if the, uh, the humor comes across correctly on that one. 
Uh, the no. Well then. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like Jack Benny. Well, I'm, 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 by God, I'm just going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully that appeals to people. If not, I, I, I don't, I don't think that's a fine pattern. Well, I appreciate it. I do too. I like it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I don't like it enough to take the torch and try to create the fire there, but. <laughs> I think mm -hmm. some some yellow and red paint right there behind the backer would look good enough. Yellow or, or um, kind of a neon orange. Yeah, mixed with a little brown might might do the trick. Tone it down a little bit. I've been trying to experiment with colors. And the way to do a floater check, by the way, is just click anywhere in the white area. And if there's anything white that is not attached to the border, then it is a floater. I, I meant to be a solid color, but all the white areas are going off the edge, so we know they're not floaters. Except for in my name there. But that wasn't supposed to be a pattern. It was supposed to be a solid color. So just for the sake of showing you, I'll show you again. That's where you would check for floaters. If it's not attached to the edge, then it's a floater. But those are attached to the edge, and that is in my name, so we're good. All right, then. This pattern is done. I will get it on the website and wait for all three of y'all to jump to it. And, and <laughs> <laughs> so I hope I hope this was uh, appealing to some people. Uh, sorry that I didn't have a lot of fanfare. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't really need it. Austin awesome. says you ask him to remind you about this pattern, Scroller Man. Oh, to give it to him. Yes, yes. I will email it to you right after. And there's Russ. <laughs> That's Wes. <laughs> by God. <He's> still... <laughs> oh, my, it, my... And, and Wes is drinking, and I can't get the dang names right. <laughs> <laughs> there you are. Wes. <laughs> Oh, I need to be a little further out, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> nice. What's he going to be standing out way out here? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that looks, right, looks really good. Much obliged, Mr. My, who's your mic is, uh, thanks for a good time, everybody. I think he's cutting out. All right. Appreciate you being here, Mr. Where did I call it? K. Koala. 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 Bing bang. Koala. Koala. Bing bang. That's funny right there. All right, Mr. Bill, it is being sent to you. And this is the one time my computer wants to freeze up. Well, he, he had the right intention, Bill. <laughs> Uh, it is being sent as we speak. It's uh, it's still attaching because it's you know, God forbid it should go quickly. And I'm I'm a little disappointed. I I wanted a little more uh, pizzazz to the pattern, but you know, it is what it is. I, I I think the pattern looks like the photo. I just thought it would pop better, but yeah, I'll uh, hopefully it appeals to somebody. I don't know why it's taking its time attaching, but hopefully it gets to you, Bill. Let me know if it doesn't. And I'll keep repeating that, and you don't have to thank me, but you're welcome. Um, uh, yeah. So. Twelve minutes after twelve is what time it is here. It feels so early because I took a late nap. <laughs> I was like, what are we going to do now? Well, we could practice pointing. I'm going to step outside, and then I'm going to bed. <laughs> All right. Well, glad to run you off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll take you with me. <laughs> I'm, oh, on God, I'm, I'm on a mobile device. I'm on a mobile device. That's when the, the rumors started right there. Uh, thank you, Steve right, Nealon. Thank you, Randy Bosheen. Thank you, Aussie Man. Thank you, everybody. Oh, that's we had here. Well, I was starting out. I started out thanking the people that were saying it looked good. And uh, thank you as well, uh, Mr. Uh, Meadows. I said your name right. Yay. Yay. 5.15 p.m. Just stick there. with Mr. Meadows. You do fine. <laughs> <laughs> I could call y'all Butt Nugget 1 and Butt Nugget 2. But... 
Well, You'd which screw one is that number up. one? You got to differentiate. Oh, well, I got Steve Neal on awake. I should probably. Did it send? Uh, Bill, if you're still here, let me know if you got it. Um, let me check my sent items. I, I think. Yeah, it looks even like. Even if he called us. Even if he called us butt nugget, he'd still screw that up. <laughs> I uh, I need to I need to make a thumbnail for the website and it'll be up there and I'll it'll be within ten minutes it'll be on the website as soon as I get it sent to uh, Steve Nealon if he's awake I'm pretty sure he is because he just said it looked good unless he's avoiding me I'm just kidding uh, let me really quickly make that thumbnail uh, da -da -da. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and folks we did that in in two hours yes yeah, sir. Or, I said we did that. Charlie did that. Well, you helped. <laughs> Steve said he's not in the office. He put it in the oh. folder and he'll get it added in the morning. All right, Mister. Much obliged. But uh, Mister. Bill should have it by now, hopefully, if he has a good email service. Uh, da -da. Thumb down, Russ. What? Wait a minute. We gotta gotta explain <laughs> that. Let's explain that. I can't afford thumbs down. <laughs> I thumbed up already. <laughs> well, let me uh blah, blah 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 i've got what what is the dimensions here 300 by 300 wide image resize 300 wide image normal filters something and I got to bring my little signature in here for the thumbnail of the website, and we will be ready to rail. I know I'm not showing anybody. But... Edit, copy. Edit, paste as a transparent selection. And Koala 1TH is what we're going to call it. K-O-L-A. Oops. K-O-A-L-A 1TH. B-E-A-R. Okay, so the pattern thumbnail is done. And per email in, in the morning, it shall be there. Oh, I'm glad the you didn't oh. say CR549. <laughs> you remember what that was? It was some kind yeah, of song sure. somewhere. Huh? It was what? It was a song somewhere, I believe. Or a, I no. don't know. No, BR549 was Junior Sample's phone number on Hee Haw. Ah, His I real know. phone number. And he actually gave it out? He gave it out because he was stupid. <laughs> he was dumb. He was just a country boy, and he gave his real phone number out as part of the show. <laughs> and he got so many phone calls. <laughs> So the fact that people tried to call the number is what's funny to me. He should have started it with 555. <laughs> Randy says, thumb down, Russ, when you point at the camera for the scroll. I can't do it like that. <laughs> Let me, uh, I'm, I'm dragging and dropping stuff into the. Uh, thumb the, down? Oh, crap on a stick. <laughs> no, I'm. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Where am I at? Dag blab it. <laughs> Bill got the pattern. Okay, he said good. it looks much better than on the live stream. Well, that's good. <laughs> 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 okay, new thumbnails. Koala. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, we're loading them to Dropbox right now. So any delay after that is all Steve Nealon. No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Why is my oh never mind. Never mind. Okay, we can go over here. We're sorry, we're not in the office. Your your message is important to us. That reminds Please me. Please stay on the line. <laughs> I have not done the uh, John Wayne and Clint Eastwood. I need to do those too. But I guess I don't need to be on the live stream to do that. They need to be uploaded to the website, too. Let me get back over her. I'll tell you what. Hashtag Babylon, he says. <laughs> <laughs> Babylon. Right there. I wonder why it looks better in person than on the live stream, because I was sharing screen, Scaring screens. 
Well, uh, folks, uh, but that it. I done did that, and I don't know what else to do now, and I don't want any louder dream that we got to do. I bet for just for giggles, they're holding me for review, because, you know, ko koalas and charity can be... Oh, look, I'm being held for review, because, you know, koalas and charity are uh, are controversial, you see. Mm -hmm. They really, seriously, are holding me for review. Wow. Wow. Oh, yeah. I love YouTube. I can't even begin to tell you how much. <clears throat> I don't want to say, but I could be responsible for some of that. <laughs> <laughs> you might be responsible for the two subscribers I lost during the day. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, I'll go resubscribe and make up for one of them. <laughs> <laughs> But I, dang it, I, I, I hate that I'm done because I'm still awake. All aboard. <laughs> <laughs> tickets, tickets, please. But I will say I appreciate everybody being here since Russ is the only one with his camera on. And I got the name right. You did. First time all night. Yep. Uh, so I'll, I'll let Russ say the magic words and the magic gesture with the correct finger. <laughs> Well, now West has okay, three, two, one. Say it, fellas. Scroll, Scroll on. on. on.